Good evening, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to Hillshanet Updates. We've got some news out of Doswell, Virginia, where there are new rumors surrounding King's Dominion, where possibly King's Dominion will be receiving a brand new roller coaster in 2021. Danny, an SNS 40 free fly is what the rumor says. Um, not what we were expecting because we had earlier rumors floating about saying that they would be getting a wing coaster. Some people even going as far as to posting a layout or saying that was a clone of something already, you know, in Asia. Um, Danny, an SNS four fly in the crypt spot, kind of out of left field here, right? Yeah, way out of left field. Uh, not something that we were expecting at all. Uh, very surprising, very unexpected. And let's be honest, kind of disappointing to hear because, you know, when we talked a few months ago, actually it was probably several months ago now, we talked about this potential wing coaster and how it seemed to be a very near clone of the Hot Go Park model. Um, you know, we said it's not particularly big in size um, and it's not too particularly different from a ride like X-Flight. Uh, it's got a, a similar layout to that for the people in the States who are familiar with the wing coasters. But we also said that if you did something along the lines of a Fleur de Demon with the theming and do some really cool stuff and the fly throughs, you could turn into a really special experience. So we kind of played both sides of the coin, right? We said it was sort of an underwhelming layout in terms of size, stature, and elements, but we also left open the possibility that you could make it a really unique experience. But, but, but let me also but, temper that and say, ultimately, I, I, I don't think that was an overwhelming rumor to begin with that, that I, I was no, it, oh my God, like I said, you it's 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 I, I thought it was kind of underwhelming to be yes. even if you did all the theming, which is a big if considering it's Cedar Fair, they're they're really they do some theming, they don't do a whole ton of it. Um, but but being that it was a clone layout, the layout itself wasn't all that exciting. I I, I don't know. I, I'd almost like the spending less money and getting a 4D free fly. I, I personally, when I go to Great America, I always find myself riding Joker. I actually really love the ride experience. And I, I think if you get a great ride where it flips a lot, like it's a ton of fun. Like people are laughing, people are having fun. There's not many times that I end up at the bottom of that hill um, waiting to go back to the station and people aren't like, oh, that wasn't amazing. Like most people riding it really enjoy it, especially the general public. And in a park where season pass holders have always been the biggest part of their business, you kind of need a ride like that. That's just fun. That's going to bring people in. It's going to be something to do. Um, it's going to be something new. There's no free flies anywhere around there. Six Flags America does not have one. The closest one is in New Jersey, right? Yeah. Yeah, I mean, I, I, I understand that. But at the same time, we have to part of the negative reaction to this too is the fact of what it would be replacing and people are saying that it would be going on majorly where the crypt was but at the same time volcano is still fresh in everybody's mind right yeah. so that's part of the reason that you're getting a lot of negative reaction to this because in a way people are thinking that is this really what they're spending that money on that they're saving from not having to take care of volcano anymore um, you know, most people I think would prefer the wing coaster. I would prefer the wing coaster. Um, even if it isn't a super gigantic or super unique layout, I would rather have the wing coaster. Um, but I, know, I, Danny, I, I'll be honest. I, I go to great America. I find myself looking, writing Joker more than I do X flight. So I, I, well, that's because you're an idiot. So, you know, I, I, I think, <laughs> but that also may be a line thing too, right? Well, it, but but I get skipped the line passes, and I always ask for Joker. I I don't know, like I, it's just it's I I think the ride experience on Joker is a lot more fun, and and there are times that you're flipping upside down, and and, and the problem is a lot of people don't like flipping upside down, so that that's where it starts. A lot of times they don't like the the random chaotic nature of it, um, yeah. and there's times that you're flipping upside down, and you're going down that little spin at the end. Um, you know, the little drop down at the end and, and it's, it's a ton of fun. And there's also some rumors out there that this one might be a little bit bigger. Maybe 
adding a few hills on the top, making it longer overall. I don't think you can make it any taller because if you made it taller, you'd have to go, you know, back and forth one more time. And I, I just, you could, I guess you could do that. I don't know if it makes the ride that much better. Um, well, you can't, you can't do like an X2 type thing. I mean, with a free spinning, you just can't do that. Well, and, 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 and if you go that big and you make it that much bigger, then s s just revealed their new Axis coaster over this winter. And if that was an option, why wouldn't you go with the Axis coaster, which seems like it kind well, of... Well, right. That's, that's the other side of this, too. If you're going to go s s why not do something unique? You know, replace something unique with something unique. But who knows? And, and, and like you said... Like you said at the beginning, um, you know, you said to me uh, in the pre-show, well, it could just be all about money, too, at the end. So it's like, well, why there, – there's, there's, there's a, a, a challenge there where if you start making it bigger and you're spending more money, then why wouldn't you just go do something else, you know? So that, there's that there. Yeah, there's that side of it, too. So I don't know. This is – this is one of those things where who really knows? Um, it would, it's, it's interesting that we've seen two rumors uh, so close together for the same part of a park. Um, you know, is this something that's in addition to the wing coaster? Is it instead of, um, you know, I, I don't know that we have a whole lot of answers on that at this yeah. point. Um, and those are maybe some answers that we'd like to get, but we're, we're just not sure if we're going to get. And, and we also said when Volcano was torn down, we also said that it was unlikely that we would see a replacement for a Volcano in the short term. So uh, we're now fully past that of Volcano being torn down, 2021 yep. looking like a small addition. May it, but then it's like, well, how much longer are you going to wait for an actual replacement for Volcano? So like yeah. you said, there's all those questions that I, I don't know if we're going to get answers to anytime soon. Is this a replacement for, for Crypt? Is this a replacement for Volcano? Are there more plans in the works? You just don't know at this point. I, I, I don't think anyone knows. Yeah, it's, it's uh, I, we have more questions than answers at this point, that's for sure. So, uh, as always, I am Andrew Barczak from Chicago, Illinois. Danny Miller from Binghamton, New York. Right on, Ride Warriors. See you guys. Thanks.